What's up, ladies and gents? Welcome to Unforgiven 2002. And look at this matchup. RVD with Ric Flair, who is the uh, general manager or part owner, I guess, uh, versus Jeff Hardy with Vince McMahon. This match was made at the last episode. In case you guys didn't watch it, you need to watch it. Not because it has Vince McMahon or something, you know, a segment like that. But in the beginning of the video, there was a uh, angle they did. I'm not going to spoil it for you guys, but uh, Jerry the King Lawler, he was in the ring with the Divas. And the rest, you need to watch it. It's pretty freaking hilarious. It's awesome. I never saw it coming. And my reaction was just unbelievable. Okay, let's just get it started now. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Unforgiven. Jim Ross here, alongside Jerry the King Law. By God, look at Unforgiven Arena. Holy crap, it looks amazing. The following contest is scheduled for one ball. Way to the ring from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. My gosh, look at that. Vince McMahon and Ric Flair, they're getting out of the ring. Uh, Jeff's entrance gave me sweat. I don't know why, don't ask me. <laughs> I wonder if Ric Flair and uh, Vince McMahon are going to fight outside. That'd be epic. I remember like, because uh, I know I, I recently played uh, SmackDown 2 and SmackDown 1. I think they have a uh, manager. If, if they're outside, they're going to fight regardless. You know, if they're divas or what kind of match is going on, they are going to fight. Uh, and uh, if it's a fatal four-way match, if, uh, you know, two guys, if they're eliminated, I think two guys, uh, if they're outside, they're going to fight. It's pretty awesome, man. I used to love that game. I mean, I still do, you know, I just don't play it as much. Don't have enough time. However, I have made a few videos for SmackDown 2 recently. I did it like a casket match, which was pretty awesome experience. Uh, what was the other match? I did Hell in a Cell. My gosh, those matches were epic. Um, it's sad that uh, Here Comes the Pain. I have the game, but I didn't play it as much. And apparently that's one of the best WWE games ever to be created. I need to play that game. If you guys want to see the gameplay, if you guys want me to play a season mode, post comments, let me know. And uh, when I get done with us, uh, you know, shut your mouth gameplay, I might just do that. Just let me know. I don't know. I, I don't like the new games these days. It's just uh, I'm going back to the old school generation. I recently bought a Wii U just because uh, a few months ago. I got a 3DS and I downloaded a bunch of like Super Mario games, like old school games at, on the virtual console uh, from NES days, you know. And that got me into the old school games. So I bought a Wii U and I tried the new Mario game. And, uh, and I bought the new Mario games for uh, 3DS and I'm in love with it, man. I just, uh, 
I'm back with Mario again. As bad as it sounds, you know. I mean, no homo. Come on, Jeff. Really, bro? Oh, yes. Reversal. You kidding me? All them punches? For what? You wasting your energy. There you go. Ric Flair. Thank you. Thank you very much. I needed that, sir. <laughs> Take that, Vince McMahon. In your face. You son of a bitch. Watch out, Riff. Oh, I jumped right, in from, you know, on top of his head. Uh, I need that finisher as soon as possible. I want to see what's going to happen at the end of the match. I wonder what kind of match they're going to make for Survivor Series. And no, it's not going to be 5 on 5. Don't ask me that. You know, somebody was really stupid enough to ask me a question. Um, consecutively, you know, I have played SmackDown vs. Raw 2011, WWE 12, and 13. I have made a bunch of videos. And around the timeline when Survivor Series comes in, I kind of do like a you know, traditional tag team match. And people ask me like, hey, why don't you do like a 5 on 5 tag team match? They don't have, they never had a 5 on 5 tag team match. Oh no. Two. Oh. I don't know if he canceled the kick out or uh, the pin or what, but um, I don't know. I was able to kick out at the right time, which I'm kind of glad. Uh oh. Pin. W one. Two. Oh wow. I got the cover. Well, that's good. What? No cutscene for uh, Vince and Ric Flair? Jeff, you mad? Chris Benoit's attire, Trish Stratus attire. Unforgiven Arena. Yeah, let's just unlock this. Awesome. 